لطفا باز شو باز کن I know you're there. You've heard the legends about yourself, right? You are the protector of love and youth. Muse of history's greatest poets. And playwrights. Your beauty is beyond compare. Powerful. Too powerful to even truly be seen. You know what I think? I think it's all bullshit. I think you're ugly. So ugly, in fact, that you've never actually taken physical form for fear that you will break every mirror that mankind has placed before you. And you were doing so well. What are you wearing? Not a wedding dress and hiking boots. I was in a rush. I was in a rock and I showed more creativity. I got you out of the rock, didn't I? I come out of my rock whenever I feel like it. Hi. I'm a huge fan. I'm returning to my rock. No, 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 no. Please wait. I... I need you, don't go. How old are you now? How old are you? Old and rude. I thought you'd have wings and be the size of a teaspoon. Again, I can go back to my rock. If you are a fairy, prove it. I'm about to materialize into this rock here in a minute. God, enough about the rock. You're outside. Breathe the air. Do you not get bored? Just, just stay with me for, for just a minute. Just, just stay here. Very. Well, I'm just super fast. Up to you. Look, so obviously we, we got off on the wrong foot. Um, just hear me out. I, I uh, took, an took an Uber and hiked over two miles just to find me. I don't know why I do that. You know, all those notes and the cut of coffee put in the car Never even left behind any fairy dust, not, not a single sign. Children don't really need to see me to believe me. You certainly didn't. That's what you think. What was that? I said I did need you. I needed to see you. I needed any kind of proof that you existed. See some magic. So in your mind, what kind of fairy wants to live in a gerbil cage? I was doing the best I could with what I had. Hour of poop. I was a kid, come on, it was cute. Whatever. You know what, this is probably not even real. This is just a, probably some hallucination because I'm dying of hypothermia. It's California. Well, then I'm dying with something else. You're so adult now. You don't believe in me, you don't believe in yourself. I believe in myself. Then why did you abandon the man you love at the altar? 
you are primed and ready to say your I do's. Even now, you're just aching to hear him say something. Oh, no, so that was real. freaked, okay? He asked me if I do and I don't. I don't want to sign my life away. What happens then? Do I owe it to him to be interesting, to be cool? <laughs> if I'm going to disappear into an us, you might as well take me now. You can take me to your magical, perfect little fucking place. I don't want to be contractually obligated to love anyone. Contractually obligated? Really? Contractually obligated. Here I was thinking it was really romantic of me coming out way into the desert to make sure the love of my life was okay. You know how I would have come with you, you selfish bastard. You now all the guests expect me to come back dragging you by the hair or, or cut you up into like a bunch of little pieces and stuff you into mason jars or something. It's gross. Yeah. <laughs> Only you in the whole world know me well enough to laugh at that, though. So. I don't want to let it go. Let it, let it go? I signed that paper. That horrible that paper. I... I don't want to lose me. I don't want to sign my life. So you don't believe in us? I do. I do. What the hell, dude? Fuck the paper. Whether it's there or not, it's just paper. What if we sign it and then the magic's come? How do you should have the coffee? <laughs> that is not how you say it. I feel like that was the best I've ever done. <laughs>